Stay tuned for President Biden and Supreme Court nominee Judge Katanji Brown Jackson. Yep, today's senator is going to get the chance to ask some really tough questions about the judge's record. Our Washington correspondent Rashad Hudson joining us with what we can expect. Good morning, Rashad. Good morning, Bill and Randy. While Judge Jackson's appointment won't affect the makeup of the court, which currently has a 6 3 conservative majority, senators say today's questioning, though, will still be very thorough. Supreme Court nominee Judge Katanji Brown Jackson told senators she plans to defend the Constitution for all. And I interpret and apply the law to the facts of the case before me without fear or favor. During opening statements, Connecticut Senator Richard Blumenthal, along with other Democrats, pointed out the historic nature of Jackson's nomination. This day is a giant leap into the present. And California Senator Dianne Feinstein praised Jackson for her experience as a federal judge and a public defender. Your background and your experience will only serve to strengthen the Supreme Court. Republicans also noted the importance of this nomination, and Texas Senator Ted Cruz previewed his line of questioning. Will a justice vote to defend your Second Amendment rights to keep and bear arms, to defend your family, to defend your children? South Carolina Senator Lindsey Graham promises Republicans will not attack Judge Jackson's character. None of us are going to do that to you. And if any of us does that to you, all hell will break out. And senators will take the next two days to question Judge Jackson on her record. Reporting in Washington, Rashad Hudson, back to you.